you made a huge decision. So how long did you know you would make such a decision? Well, it was a, a quite uh, a, ref a decision I reflected upon for quite a while, so I knew I would wait for the end of the summer, but I already said I would make such a decision to join Juventus because for me it was very important to take such a step outside my home country and outside Ajax as well, but more or less I decided that after the first final. Well, you look very calm, very quiet, serene. So you are 19 years old. Uh, there are newspapers. I've been writing pages and pages about you. So why are you so calm? Yes, I know. I know that I look very calm and quiet. I know there are lots of people that are particularly happy that I've joined Juventus. But uh, obviously, there have been other reactions to this decision of mine, so this means I have to get used to a new environment, a new sporting culture, and I truly hope I will be able to do the best with my performance. Nerozzi, Corriere della Serie, Corriere di Torino, would like to ask you two questions. First, if during the transfer you got in contact with uh, uh, Maurizio Sari on the phone and if the way he plays football influenced your decision, and then yesterday we saw a picture of you when you were young, Okay, I'll ask you this question later. Uh, well, I spoke to him on the phone, <clears throat> really short, just uh, to get to know each other and nothing more. And well, he's also one of the reasons I uh, wanted to come to Juventus because I heard a lot of good stories about him, the way he plays, the philosophy he has, the attacking football, the defending line, how we, how we prepare them. So obviously there was a big reason to, to come here. And then I would like to ask you, yesterday saw so an Instagram, a picture of you when you were young with the Juventus jersey. So why did you have that? Uh, was that a present? Uh, were there any uh, players at Juventus that you particularly admired at that time? Yes, I think I was like seven years old at that time. I think it was in 2006, 2007. And yeah, if you, have, if you are a defender, I think you already know which player I admired, admired at that moment. It was uh, Fabio Cannavaro, the, yeah, the player who won the World Cup 2006, who won the Ballon d'Or 2006. So, yeah, I think uh, at that moment I was really a big fan of him. But I obviously always had a good feeling with Juventus. Uh, 